Who do you want to talk to on a given night? Who, who's the guy you got to talk to? Harold and I said, Fernando Tatis Jr., please make it happen. And Fernando Tatis Jr. is standing by now and joins us on MLB tonight. Fernando, you've played, first off, congratulations on an amazing night. You've played 145 big league baseball games, including tonight. Was this the best game you've ever played? Yeah. <laughs> yeah tell me yeah, why, man. man. Tell just, me why. Just the energy, the energy, man, the energy that, that we brought today uh, and how we feed from each other and how it was not one a guy game like – it was Will. It was Manny. It was it was it was, it was everybody. It was everybody. Everybody. The pitching. Everybody. And uh, just glad. Just glad to be part of it. So walk me through that key at bat. Okay, you guys are down. Everyone's thinking it, it, you haven't hit a home run yet, and then you sparked it. So walk me through what you were looking for when you hit that missile left field to bring your guys back within one. <laughs> oh man, it was a couple at bat that I, I missed. No, it was. I feel like it was key for us. And then after that, I was just looking for my fastball, and I feel like he just hang a breaking ball, and I just, I just react to it. It's part of the game. Yeah, no, you, you you did an amazing job. So let me ask you this, Fernando: Is how, how much has playing with Manny elevated your game? And what are some of your conversations with him? Man, I mean, like. We just we we bring everybody we bring each other a game every single day. We feed from each other and we learn we learn from each other. And, do you guys uh, compete? Especially me from his Do you his compete part. against each other? <laughs> like I did this, I dare you to do that. <laughs> we have to, man. It's part of the game. It's part of the game, man. And like I I learn I have learned a lot from that guy. You know, just every time we have a chance, we we've been talking about situation. And, uh, you know, what What should we do f to get this better? And just different part, man. Just, you guys have me a lot. Ooh. <laughs> Don't you worry about it. We can still <laughs> see you. They try to take the lights out on the star, man. What? What? I know you can snap your fingers and it comes back on. <laughs> you. Yeah, that's, that's how magical you are. Hey, uh, uh, let, let me ask you this. Uh, after watching the postseason, not being in it last year, and seeing Soto and all these uh, Acuna and all the young guys doing their thing, how important was it for you to get into the postseason and be able to shine? Oh, man, it was huge. It was huge. Just being able to be part of a postseason, just what what it meant for, for, for the organization of the Padres without being in postseason 14 years, what it meant for the city, for the fans. I'm just grateful the way we have played and, you know, being able to have the chance. We just, it's great, man. I'm just grateful right now. Yeah, I mean, dude, grateful for the weight room, too, because I remember meeting you before in spring training before last <laughs> year, and you look, you're like a different guy. That's it's, why you turn the lights out, because the guns are accentuated. I'm telling you, they grow up so fast. <laughs> um, Fernando, for real, though, when you guys were down 4 nothing in this game, it's an elimination game. You lose, you guys are out, right? Were you guys saying anything in the dugout? It's 4 nothing. Was anyone talking in, on your end to try to get the mojo back? Man, just everybody, let's go, let's go. And, like, who's going to get it started? And, uh, man, like, this team, we're never out of the game. We're never out of the game since since the beginning of this season. And, uh, you know, this game was, like you said, was elimination, you know, down for nothing. We were never out of it. And uh, we did, uh, we did, we find the way and we did the job. It was the important thing. All right, Jack Flaherty, what do you know about him? Have you faced him before? Uh, I heard a lot about him. Uh, uh, I think I haven't faced him before, but it's going to be a great game tomorrow. Yeah, no doubt. As long as Yadier Molina figures out how to, I don't know, how did he catch that foul tip off your bat? Oh my gosh. How did that happen? <laughs> For real? Like, I was, uh, were you shocked? <laughs> uh, man, I was like, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm just used to it, man. I'm just used to it. Seeing Yadi doing all that stuff is is part of what he got bring to this game, what he had done for so long, and he's one of the greatest to ever do it, man. Uh, you know what? You're a pretty special talent, and uh, are you gonna put a show on tomorrow night? Is that what we're expecting from Fernando Tatis Jr.? <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm just gonna bring my energy, man, and then every every everything's gonna take care of. Awesome. Fernando Tatis Jr., we greatly appreciate you coming out, even in the dark, when they turn the lights off and doing this interview with us. Uh, we <laughs> love watching you play, and best of luck in game three, okay? <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you. And the fans are cheering, but I don't know where they came from, but that's how big he is.